Ryan the Humphead Rass was born on June 16th, 2018, but little did his family know he would be the Rass to change it all. Ryan was three human years old, which is 12 years old in Rass years. Son, wake up. It's take your child to work day. But dad, I was going to go play with the seahorses. Nope, you're coming with me. It will be so much fun. Richard Rass, Ryan's father, worked for the Coral Guard and helped protect the coral reef. Little did Ryan know this would be his father's last day at work. All guards, there's been a breach. Report to that hook. This is not a drill. Ryan, go hide under the reef. D Dad, you'll come back, right? I'll be right back, I promise. Ryan peeked over the coral and watched as his father and many other guards desperately tried to remove the hook from the reef. After what seems like hours, the hook was finally released, taking his father with it. Ryan's mom hasn't come home yet, and it is really late. I'm going to look for mom. I'm coming too. Ryan and his brother searched the coral reef until they thought all hope was lost. Then they stumbled upon their mother's favorite hat. Mom would never go anywhere without her hat. Ryan turned to find that his brother was no longer by his side. He immediately checked his surroundings, and glancing up, he saw his brother's last gasp of water before he disappeared above the surface. Suddenly, a fisherman's hook appeared to his left and was rapidly moving toward him. Ryan sensed immediate danger and swam home as quickly as he could. When Ryan reached his house, he found it destroyed by another fisherman's hook. He searched the ruins for his sister, his only remaining family member, but she was nowhere to be found. Ryan would quickly discover that his species was on the e extinction. Reuben, I've lost my whole family to the fisherman's hook. I don't know how I can live without them. Well, that sucks. My only advice is to just keep swimming. Thank you, Reuben Rass. You're such a lifesaver. On Ryan's way home, he felt a strange sensation that someone or something was watching him. Before he could turn around, a hook penetrated his top fin. He was immediately swept up towards the surface. Where large hands grabbed him and dropped him in a box on his boat. As Ryan flopped around, he heard a distant voice say, Hey dude, you know you just got a rest, right? You need to throw that back, man. Those are endangered species, you know? They help the coral reefs stay healthy and balanced. We need those coral reefs, man. If they weren't around, it would mess up the whole ecosystem. Nice catch, though, bro. Oh, man. I didn't know that. I've caught my fill for today. I can throw one back. Ryan breathed a sigh of relief as he was tossed back into the sea. Ryan Rass has lived out most of his life. He has a wife and three kids. Ricky Rass, Rhonda Rass, and Rabio Rass. Ryan's story, though tragic, gave us an insight into the struggles that Humphead rats are enduring every day. This is due to the overfishing issues in Asia. <laughs> the Humphead rats are very important to our ecosystem. They help contribute to protecting the reefs from other harmful sea creatures. We need to do our part to spread awareness to save those amazing creatures and our coral reefs from overfishing.